This is Kanga. This is Rue. Kanga Rue. I.e. Mia and Sophia. What is up, Rad Fam? Today we're going to do some local exploring on some local trails. And we're going to take the dogs with us. And we're going to camp in our backyard tonight. But before we do that, we have some exciting things to open. We got some packages here. Uh, Woo! What do we got? We got some Roadrunner bags. Because we're going to switch to a bike packing setup. We got to get more trails but, oh. in the next step. Oh, oh, I'm stoked about this. OK, that's a good. This has nothing to do with bike packing. It has everything to do with stylish handlebar bag for rolling around town. Breaks, not people. Yes. They thrive because of rad people. Oh, is that what it says? Yeah. Nice. I didn't oh, expect it to be that structure. That's, that's cool. Nice. It's like a plastic insert that wraps around itself. <gasps> what do we got? have, Sophia? What is this one? Ooh, these are going to be my fork yes, bags. Yes, that's cool. Yeah, so you can wash it. Man, everything is super high quality. And it is waterproof as well. Mm -hmm. Oh, and it has the firm thing on the top, so it folds. Mm. Yeah. Handle oh, bar Oh, yes. A satisfying sound. Mm, tight roll right there. Okay. Oh, it's the same kind of thing. Mm, that's nice. Yeah, you so can you can really clean it. Clean it out. Big round bag, and underneath there's a support. So it's kind of like your burrito mm, bag. Oh, yeah. It has just like probably a plastic insert. This, this is, is the Middle Earth. It looks Middle Earth with color. Yeah. Oh, this is my Middle Earth bag. Look, it matches my sandals. See that? See that, that coordination? We're gonna rock it today and see how it goes. Woo! Here's another bag we got on sale, actually. This one's by Topeak, and I'm giving this a go. Topeak 10 liter backloader. I'm gonna try it out for the first time today on our little late night ride. Probably going out at like 5.30 p.m. because it's so stinking hot. But yeah, I'm gonna see if I can fit the sleeping quilt in here. It comes with a little dry stack, which is nice. The really nice thing about this is there's this valve at the bottom. So then you can squeeze out excess air and really get this to you pack down. Although I guess the, the danger with this, with this is that you end up packing more stuff. Cool. Yeah, I could still fit Plenty. some more stuff in there if I wanted to. Sweet oh, baby girl. It's, it's just so hot. It's so hot. Oh. Hey, you want to go outside do stuff? cooling vest on nice and wet and cold and we've got their bells well you gotta take the magnet out are you jingling oh you're jingling over here Sophia evening camping trip here we go <laughs> Bike speed is perfect for dogs. Good girls. I am so happy right now. <laughs> this is pure joy. Yeah, I like being outside with my bike. Mm -hmm. The pups make it. Good girls. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Come on. Go. <laughs> 
or learning. backyard spin. Okay, this is the beginning of a lot of pushing. I have to say, I do like having the weight in the front here. It makes it a lot easier when you have to get off and push than having the weight lagging behind you. So I do recommend a little weight up front. Personal preference. But if you think it looks steep in the video, it is that steep. Oh. Man, it's just so loose. Yeah. Uh, all right, I just gotta put my head down and go. It's a tough one, huh? Yeah, it's a tough one, I know. We'll get some water over there. Whatever you want to. Just a cotton t-shirt, cotton shorts. <laughs> Don't recommend that when it's gonna be raining, but I'm pretty comfy right now. Just a little more climbing. I love the wind. Yeah, it feels so good. Oh, oh I know we're getting a great ocean breeze right now. It feels amazing. Uh-huh. That's cooling. Prime time. Prime time. It's gonna be really pretty around this turn too. Alright, let's get up there. We just got a nice downhill now. Yeah, I think we have two happy pups. All right. Well, I have to say I'm pretty stoked on the new setup. Those are actually Darren's bags. I stole them for the for the tester. I might get some myself. But yeah, this uh, all felt good so far. I'm liking it. All right, time to set up camp very quickly. Although we have we have some outdoor lights, so we could always cheat with those <laughs> and uh, start with the barbecue. Let's do this. That's all we're gonna need tonight. It's pretty warm still. Oh, you're a very wet dog. You cannot come in yet. No, no, no. They're very intrigued at what I'm doing though. I sleep in here tonight and you gotta be nice and dry and tick free. Uh-huh. Darren's getting the BBQ set up. Mm. So a nice thing about camping at home, <laughs> get access to your fridge. Uh, we're totally cheating. Where's my kombucha? Homemade kombucha. But the real question is, Darren. Yes. Are you gonna shower? Yeah. Yes. Yeah, so hot. Cold showers. A two minute shower. Like you're at a campsite. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna time it. Let's do that. Timed oh. shower. <laughs> Timed shower. Oh. You're at the campsite. It's two minutes and there's no hot water. Here we go. Let's go. Yep. Yup. 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 Those are for you. Get out of town. So we are super excited to get to try mm -hmm. this um, Fernway Food Company Mushroom Pot Pie Dehydrated Adventure Meal. Mm -hmm. This is a vegan meal, but we're going to make it non-vegan by adding a little steak. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's just one se serving, so we were like, oh, this could be a cool, uh, really delicious side. We've heard they're really good, and they do eco packaging. This is not a sponsored video, by the way. This is compostable, so it actually will just completely compost within, I think they said, like a year or six months. I can't remember. I'll put it down at the bottom of the screen. But yeah, we're going to give this a go and cook it on our pot over the BBQ. Hi, look who it is. Actually, these are camp chairs that we found in a trash can. Nice. And we rescued them. 
someone was throwing them away. Look at them, they're like never used. I think I know why though, they're really, really heavy. <laughs> this thing is like 15 pounds, but for some backyard camping, they'll do the job. Vegans look away. <laughs> Darren set up the remote to control the music, the music that's playing, and her beer. I don't have OCD. You're ready for the evening. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let's get down with this steak. I uh, I found some tomato bushes over there, so I just grabbed some. Nice. Hope that's okay. <laughs> <laughs> Always okay. Backyard foraging. Mmm. <laughs> okay, we're trying the pot pie for the first time. That's really good for a prepackaged meal. It it tastes way more um tastes way more like real food mm, mm -hmm. very mushroomy Ooh, i don't even know what i've just been into oh that's, the biscuit mm, that's Ooh. good okay that's really good okay mm. we grated some fresh parmesan oh, yeah. to add okay. so we're not we we're not vegan yeah. so we're gonna add cheese to that this is looking familiar by the way mm -hmm. this is reminiscent of our trip I did the Hi Hey Hello magazine contest. Mm -hmm. And actually I'm gonna sit down and read that tonight too. Not sponsored at all by anything, but it's an awesome magazine. You should check it out. It's mm -hmm. got a lot of really cool stories from all like female athletes doing all sorts of outdoors activities, which is really awesome. Yeah. It's really well written. And um, we won some prizes and these are some of the prizes that we won. So we got the meal, the dinner meal and a breakfast meal. So we'll have the breakfast tomorrow morning. We'll let you know how that is, but so far, Fernway, I'm impressed. Very, very delicious. Mm -hmm. Mia, Tobia, would you like a piece of steak? Look at this face. I think that face means yes. <laughs> she She's like, I've been waiting yes. here patiently. Enjoy this. Delicate. <laughs> she takes the food so delicately. Oh. Sophia's gonna bite it out of my hand. Yeah. Oh. Good girl. That's it. That's it. There Sorry. you go. You get a tomato if you want. You can have a tomato. You can cook. I'm just <laughs> like it. <laughs> so Darren was just like, okay, good night. And they just followed her in. Oh. <laughs> that was hilarious. They just followed you right in. Hi. 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 Oh. oh. <laughs> we were like, are they going to be worried? Like, are they not going to, are they not going to want to go in here? Are they going to be freaked out? No, they just waltzed right in. They're like, oh, bedtime? Okay. And they've made themselves quite a tome. Well, cold won't be an issue. No. This one's quite cozy as well. Oh, somebody took all the blankets. Your little bagel down there, all cozied up with our blankets. I did bring their blanket in. Yeah, I saw that. Yeah, I was, this is the cutest thing I've ever seen. But where am I gonna sleep? Am I just like Ooh, here there. on the on the foot pads? <laughs> See, there you are. Uh, that's Great. your bed. <laughs> <laughs> the dogs have taken over. Yeah, I will be sleeping on my <laughs> sit pad with a paw digging into me. Oh, into your neck. Yeah. She's got my pillow. Uh, it looks very comfortable over here, I see. Yeah. I see how this, this is a good setup out. for myself. Three person tent. Look at <laughs> One person, two dogs. <laughs> oh. You like snoogling. Yeah, she does. This is yeah. my baby for the night. This is my baby for the night. Hmm. Is that a tick? Hmm. Maybe. You gotta come inside. Yeah. Every morning. Every morning. Yeah, get the latch. Excuse me. <laughs> Are you comfy? Yeah. It's comfy now, yeah. is it? It's not as comfy now, is it? Well, that was an experience. There was a lot of uh, nose booping and face licking. Hey, get up. Hey, get up. What's going on? Some growls. I think there's like a rat or something living under there. And so they wanted to alert us to that. Yeah, see there. Leave it. Leave it. 
but overall, I mean, I didn't sleep terribly. Darren did not sleep great, but we fit. <laughs> but I am worried that they're going to um, tear through this tent, so we might have to look for something different just because of, yeah, the material, the ultralight material. Oh, girls. Oh, girls. Breakfast. We're going to try the sweet potato breakfast bowl. Oh. Darren made herself a fancy coffee. Ah, it's the luxury of being in your backyard. <laughs> what I forgot to mention about these is that they choose seasonal foods and it's, I think most of it's locally grown in near Portland, Oregon. Yeah, nice. And so they do everything seasonal and then they say like, you should just stock up on the seasonal items when you want them because they won't make them when it's out of season. So that's really cool. Mm -hmm. All right, we got our sweet potato breakfast bowl. Kind of looks like refried, refried beans pretty good there's like nuts and coconut flakes and kind of cinnamon flavoring that's pretty tasty definitely a good change up from oats <laughs> what else is in there cheese seeds coconut oil dates i think dates sweet potato mm. that's good darren what do you think mm -hmm. it is good it's very mm. rich yeah it's rich mm -hmm. you definitely want to have your coffee with it or some juice or something That seems like it would be really filling, which is always good with breakfast because I feel like whenever I eat oatmeal, I'm like hungry a half hour later. <laughs> All right, that was a camping success, I would say. We did it. We backyard camped. We had the girls in the tent. It was a learning experience, <laughs> but we can check it off the list. So hopefully you enjoyed the video. Give us a thumbs up if you liked that. Subscribe for more content, and we'll see you in the next one. Remember to rat on. Darren made this bowl. Mm. Mm -hmm. Ceramicist. Ceramist. Is it ceramist? I think so. Ceramic ceramic bowl maker. Maybe? I don't know. Beautiful. Mm -hmm. Good job. Mm-hmm. A woman of many talents. Mm -hmm. But I think you already knew that. Mm. Humble to you. It was a throne pot. Huh? A throne pot. A throne pot? Throne. It was throne. Oh. Not hand built, but throne. Mm, I was thinking of throne because you're a queen mm. and you're sitting upon it. So I was like, oh, okay. okay. It's for royalty only. Neighbors are vacuuming. Mm -hmm. And the battery's dead, so goodbye. Bye!